I ended chemical fertilizers forever with this natural mix. The growth results honestly shocked me. There's a quiet revolution happening in home gardens, and it starts with a bucket, a few natural ingredients, and, well, an open mind. For years, many gardeners believed lush, fast growth could only come from chemical fertilizers. But the truth is, those bright green leaves and heavy harvests you crave can come straight from a living, natural formula you can make at home. When I first tried this mix, I didn't expect much. Two weeks later, I was staring at explosive growth. Bigger roots, thicker stems, and leaves so vibrant they looked photoshopped. That's when I knew I'd found a way to end chemical fertilizers forever. Most gardeners use chemical fertilizers because they promise instant results. But what they don't tell you is that they quietly destroy your soil's life. Chemical fertilizers feed plants directly but starve the soil microbes that actually make nutrients available. Over time, your soil becomes dependent, hard, lifeless, and infertile. You start needing more fertilizer each season just to maintain the same yield. The natural formula we're about to discuss, well, it flips that system completely. Instead of forcing growth, it rebuilds soil health. It works by feeding the living microorganisms, bacteria, yeast, and fungi, that turn organic material into plant-available nutrients. Once your soil becomes alive again, it starts feeding your plants naturally, making chemical fertilizer obsolete. This simple yet powerful fertilizer works on one principle, microbial fermentation. By fermenting a combination of sugar, yeast, and organic matter, we create billions of beneficial microbes that break down minerals and make them instantly available to plants. Unlike synthetic fertilizers, which dump salts into your soil, this solution enhances microbial life, giving your plants a steady, natural nutrient flow that lasts. And the best part? You can make it right at home using ingredients you already have. Here's the exact formula that transformed my garden ingredients. Two tablespoons of dry yeast, and any baking yeast works. Four tablespoons of brown sugar or molasses, five liters of clean, chlorine-free water, and one cup of compost or topsoil to introduce native microbes. All right, let's dive into how to make this wonderful microbial fertilizer. First, pour the water into a large, clean bucket or a plastic container. Now, add the sugar and give it a good stir until it's completely dissolved. Next, sprinkle in the yeast and mix it lightly. Remember, don't cover it tightly. It needs to breathe a bit. Then, add the compost or topsoil and give it another stir to introduce those beneficial microbes. Cover it loosely and let the mixture ferment for about 24 to 48 hours in a warm place. During this time, the yeast activates, multiplying the beneficial microbes. The sugar serves as food for them, while the compost introduces local microbial strains that adapt perfectly to your soil. You might notice some light bubbling and a pleasant yeasty smell. These are signs of a living solution. After two days, your microbial fertilizer concentrate is ready to use. Now, this solution is quite powerful, so it needs to be diluted before you use it. Always remember, concentrated microbes work best when they're gently introduced to the soil. The dilution ratio is simple. Mix one cup of the fermented solution in 10 liters of water. Stir it well before application. For seedlings, water the base lightly once every seven days. For mature plants, drench the soil around the roots every five to seven days. And for foliar feeding, spray on the leaves using the same diluted mix once every two weeks, preferably in the evening or early morning. You'll start noticing results pretty quickly. Within a week or two, the leaves will become a deeper green, stems will thicken, and new growth will accelerate. Now, let's talk a bit about the science behind this mix. The fermentation process releases natural plant boosters, amino acids, enzymes, and growth hormones that act like a multivitamin for your crops. But what truly makes it stand out is the microbial activity.
When these microbes enter the soil, they break down locked up nutrients that plants couldn't access before. They release nitrogen, phosphorus, and potassium naturally. They also improve root health by creating a balanced underground ecosystem. Plus, they protect against harmful soil pathogens through microbial competition. Over time, your soil becomes rich and dark, with a soft texture that holds moisture better and drains evenly. That's why gardeners who switch to this method notice healthier, longer-lasting crops, and they never go back to chemicals again. When I applied this mix for the first time, I treated half my vegetable bed with it and left the other half untreated. In just two weeks, the difference was staggering. The treated plants were twice as tall, with stronger stems and a noticeably richer green color. The untreated side looked dull and weak. After a full month, even the soil texture had changed. The treated side was soft, full of tiny white fungal threads, proof of active life underground. Meanwhile, the untreated side was dry and crumbly. It was clear this wasn't just a fertilizer, it was a soil rebirth formula. For optimal effectiveness, always use non-chlorinated water, since chlorine kills beneficial microbes. Rainwater or stored tap water, left to sit for 24 hours, works perfectly. Keep your mix away from direct sunlight while fermenting, as heat kills microbial activity. You can also enhance this base formula by adding natural boosters like 1 tablespoon of wood ash, which adds potassium and micronutrients, a handful of crushed eggshells for calcium, and 1 tablespoon of blended banana peel to add phosphorus for flowering plants. Each addition strengthens the nutrient profile while remaining 100% organic. Unlike chemical fertilizers that only feed plants temporarily, this natural fertilizer works cumulatively. Every time you apply it, your soil grows more fertile and self-sustaining. After a few months of use, you'll notice you need to water less often, your plants resist pests better, and harvests taste richer and more nutritious. Healthy soil produces healthy plants, and healthy plants produce nutrient-dense food. It's a full circle of life that industrial fertilizers can never replicate. Even if you grow in containers or small spaces, this method brings your soil alive again. The microbial life doesn't just feed the roots. It creates a thriving ecosystem that transforms even poor soils into fertile ground. Some gardeners worry that fermentation might produce a bad smell. If your mix smells rotten or sour, it means harmful bacteria have taken over, usually because it was sealed too tightly or left too long. Always allow airflow and keep fermentation time under 48 hours. Others ask whether they can store it. The answer is yes, but refrigerate or keep in a cool, shaded area for no more than 7 days. Shake before use to reactivate the microbes. And if you're wondering whether it works for all crops, yes. From leafy greens to fruiting plants like tomatoes, peppers, and even root vegetables, this formula delivers astonishing results. Once you witness how this microbial fertilizer transforms your garden, chemical options start to feel outdated. Why rely on synthetic salts when you can grow with living power? This method gives you control over what goes into your soil, ensuring you grow food that's clean, nutrient-dense, and eco-friendly. Chemical fertilizers create dependency. This natural solution builds independence. You stop feeding the plant directly and start feeding the life that sustains it. That's the difference between temporary growth and long-term abundance. Ending your use of chemical fertilizers doesn't mean lowering your yields. In fact, it's the opposite. This simple, homemade microbial fertilizer unlocks a level of plant growth and soil health that commercial products can't match. Once you start, you'll see your plants respond with explosive energy, and your soil begin to breathe again. If you found this guide valuable, subscribe to Growth Hub Central Crops for more natural growth secrets, real gardening experiments, and proven formulas that actually work. Don't forget to share this video with fellow growers who want to ditch chemicals for good and experience the power of living soil.